Let me show you guys right quick when I'm throwing right here. I'm uh, getting desperate here lately. I haven't caught many fish. I've been getting skunked. So I uh, took a little jig head. Paints all wore off of it. I ended up sticking this little Berkeley Gold Meadow on there. I'm trying to catch crappie. I've caught some crappie out of this hole right here. Um, I just got here just a couple minutes ago, so that's a good sign that I'm catching fish already. But yeah, I've just got this it's all tore up right now. Just got it a little rigged up, just throwing it, throwing it out there on a the bobber. And I've got another rod with a beetle spin that I throw around while I've got this thing sitting out there. That's it. See if we can get another one. Fish. Oh, that's a good one. Whatever that is. Got my ultralight here. Got him on the Berkeley Gulp minnow on a jig head. What is that? Catfish? Oh man. He got that thing down. Let's see if I can swing him up here. Oh. Look at that. Wasn't expecting catfish, but. So I'll take it. If I can grab a hold of this guy without him sticking me. Stay still. Stay still. I've been stuck by a saltwater catfish and that wasn't fun. There we go. Look at that. Catfish. Meow. 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 I was going to keep some fish today, but I didn't bring a bucket or anything to put them in. But anyways, that'd be a good one to eat right there. It's like something's wrong with its tail. It got hit by a butt or something. I don't know. All right, we'll throw them back in there. I'm gonna show you guys how I just rigged up my orange peel beetle spin. Just, just tore off a little piece of it, small piece, kind of wider on one end, narrower on the other. Just hooked it one time. like that right there it actually looks pretty good when it's running through the water I'll leave it leave the camera rolling right quick and see if we can get one while we're recording here just slowly trolling it in I actually was giving that one a little pop when he hit that Hit it right, right when it passed that rock right there. Fish on. Look at that. There we go. I don't think anybody's gonna believe me when I tell them what I just did there. As you can see, I've got a beetle spin with just a plain jig. Nothing on it. See that? No jig. I'll show you what I had on it. It came off. Actually, it's floating in the water right there. A the little orange thing. Let's walk over here. I just put a piece of orange peel right there that I just had for a snack on this jig head and caught a crappie. I don't know if I can believe it or not, but it worked. It's a bright color. That's what they go for. Look at that little guy right there. Beautiful. Caught him. There's a little rock right in the water there. I kept seeing something chasing it. 
he actually came up and got it. I'm gonna let him go. There's the orange peel right there floating in the water. Guys, I just did it again. This time the orange peel is still on the hook. That way you believe me. Look at this. Look at that. It actually looks pretty good going through the water. Nice little bluegill there. Yeah, buddy. I got to come up with a name for that. The old pumpkin runner or something. Orange pumpkin. We'll figure it out. Keep going. All right, guys, we're all done fishing for the day. Um, I fished for about three hours today. There was a lot of boat traffic, a lot of people out on the lake. Beautiful day today. Uh, we were able to catch three different fish, catfish, crappie, and a bluegill. And I'll tell you, you know, if, if you're not getting bites on certain baits, try something different. And that's what I did with the orange peel. Um, I mean, it, it's it's bright colors. It doesn't really surprise me that I caught anything on it. But, uh, you know, I might have to try something similar to that. Different fruit next time, maybe. Who knows? But anyways, appreciate you guys watching. Um, I'm, I'm going to try to get the kayak. I got to do a little bit of work to the kayak before I can take it out. Some of the handles are rotted off. But I'm going to repair that up. And uh, hopefully we're going to be able to get that out on the lake soon. Y'all stick around. Thanks.